What's going on everyone? Good morning. So today I'm going for a tattoo. So I'm going to my friend JP. He is an amazing artist and uh, I've seen a lot of the, uh, the work that is done for some of my friends and it is next level. Guarantee you, you will not be sorry if you use this guy's services, man. Um, so I'll put his uh, link in the description below and on some of his details as well. So this would be my second tattoo ever. Only my second tattoo. And the last time I did one was in 2008, I think 2007 or 2008, somewhere around there. So uh, I don't quite know what to expect. Uh, I guess the feeling's the same. I don't think that'll change. I think the technology is the same. And uh, but I just hope I don't faint because that would be so embarrassing. simple tattoo um, it's nothing fancy and it's something simple that really speaks about my life and where I am right now nothing deep bro sad or anything like that um, it's just where I am and, um, and where I want to be and where I want to go so I think a lot of tattoos are actually statements, um, you know, that people want to say without saying it. So that's where I'll be going, Samurai Empire. I'll give you the details. I'm just so fascinated with the scenery, man. Hello. Oh yes, yes, yes. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is my man JP, Samurai Empire. <laughs> yes, thanks. You don't mind me for me. Eh? Thanks, man. So I arrived at Samurai Empire, and this is where it's gonna go down. I'm still nervous. <laughs>
So that's before. Ooh. I'm going to put on my shades. That's just in case I cry. Then I have that. <laughs> you can't see me cry. So people are always asking me, what's next? Or uh, where to next? You know, and uh, it's actually become part of my, my, my ritual. Yeah. So I'm always on the move, always doing stuff. Um, so I like traveling and you know, I like making music that kind of stuff so it's always like what what kind of music I actually, makes. I actually remember you guys from the whole music segment yeah, yeah. Um, I definitely remember the jam sessions was always amazing yeah absolutely I they, think I think I think originality takes a very very strong tone to things yeah so also believing in your identity believing in what you're all about Absolutely. The wind is full of art here. Yeah. Being with it to the end, if I may use that term. Yeah, yeah. Like, like for me with the Japanese culture, it's my roots may not have been Japanese, but mm. I saw the Japanese. Okay. I always found my fascination with Japan. Wow. I did all my research, ended up understanding the minds of a, a guy called Oda Nobunaga. Um, oh, right. Tokugawa and Yatsu, the unifiers of Japan. Mm -hmm. So it's just my goal now to unify the world. So would that be the stencil? Wow. All right, that's it, guys. We're done. <laughs> well, that was easy. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> All right. Now you get an idea of what it uh, what goes down. Behind the scenes. Behind the scenes. So, guys, I'm gonna leave the uh, the details to Samurai Empire uh, down below in the description. Uh, I'm also gonna link um, the handles, Insta, Twitter. How long have you been doing tattooing? So I've been tattooing for over a decade now. Wow. A lot has changed. A lot wow, has changed. Wow, over a decade. So I'm, on my, I'm, I'm going for my 11th year of tattooing. Wow. Generally fitting to the mainstream society world. Yeah. So I ended up building and growing and forging my own street. Yeah. But it all started with just doing art and stuff. Yeah, right? I, was, I was very, I won't say autistic, I would say artistic. Artist is very bad. So then what inspired you to, to take this step to go to tattoo? Um, so so prior to the, to the tattoo career for me it was more it was more so I was doing a lot of paintings. Mm -hmm. So I was selling my drawings, paintings, whatever the case may be. But I needed something to perform me a little bit more. I needed my, my, my artwork to to give it a little bit of a stronger punch. Yeah. And I found myself human canvases. So my story, my story ends up being on their body and when I got to the point where everyone knew my story, now it's my thing to give back to you and it's your thing to tell me about your demons that you conquered. Wow. It is actually, there's a little there's a bit more than a tingle um, but I gotta say it's not overwhelmingly painful it's to the point where I can actually tolerate it to be honest but uh, he's not done yet so we'll see I think he's still taking it easy <laughs> are you? we destroy them after 
<laughs> pain only starts happening when you're on your last push up. Uh, and the pain factor kicks in, and then I start coming. Wow. But I, I do feel sorry for people, though, that will do the. Uh, what do you call them when you have to color them in, you have to uh, shade it as well, and all those things? So, it's just the, in a nutshell, just a very long fucking session. Okay. No, sorry that I probably swore on you. You edit the language people. No, 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 it's all good. It's all good. It's not made for children. Okay, cool, <laughs> by the way, it's not made for children. Yeah. Cool, people, people try to overdo it, man. Yeah. People love this, this natural lifestyle. People love the fact that it's okay to be yeah. original. Yeah. You can't hear bullshit coming from it, to be honest with you. Exactly. Yeah, so actually what I want to say is that I didn't come for a tattoo today, I came for an experience. That's basically what, what happened today. You know? So many profound uh, conversations and words spoken. I did not expect it at all. But I do, I do apologize for the, for, the, for the little bit of a bleep in here as well, guys. Wow, guys, and that is after. <laughs> I had to do a shot up before as well. So there we go. This is the experience at Samurai Empire. This is my man. I think I and my Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. Hey guys, so there you have it. That's the story behind my tattoo. It serves as a reminder to me that I just gotta keep going. I'm always seeking that next thrill, or that next beat, or the next destination. I hope that you got inspired by this and I hope that you find your next whatever that may be peace out